Hey everybody, it's me Peter. Okay, so before I say anything, let me just say, YouTube, that this whole webcam recording function blows. You are terrible. I'm the second time recording this, and every time I try and make a video, it ends up recording like eight times, and each time it fails or disconnects. So, fix it, YouTube. Or Google, whoever's in charge now. Grrr. Alright, well that was refreshing. Um, I made a list, so I'm going to read off it real quick. Um, but apologies, I don't have my glasses on, and without my glasses I can't see. But, I'm so handsome, so why would I hide behind glasses for you guys? I wouldn't, that's why. Alright, so this weekend I performed a wedding, and it's great. Uh, by the way, if you didn't know, I am an ordained minister, and I really like that. Um, not like the kind of like, oh, I preach to people, but the kind where I got ordained so I could marry people. Um, being a kind of, not really spiritual, but philosophical guy, I really like the ability to do that, um, and I think love is great, and I am all for people who love each other getting married. Um, so yeah, and just getting to talk about love is such a nice feeling, um, because, I don't know, I like to think in some small way I help these people who decide to get married stay married for a little bit longer, because you know what I do? I keep it real. You know, I say things like, you know, love may seem all great and make you feel all fuzzy, but the truth is, it sucks sometimes. Sometimes love is the worst, because people will make you so mad, and if it was some stranger, you wouldn't even care. But the truth is, the person who made you mad is the person who made you so angry, is the person you love so much. And they make you so angry because you love them. Uh, so it's a double-edged sword, but understand that you are mad because you love them. And if you didn't, you wouldn't care. So suck it up and work it out. Learn to talk to each other. Alright. And that's every wedding I've ever performed in like a minute, in like half a minute. Well played, me. I just put myself out of a job. No, I'm just kidding. Uh, what else? I booked my VidCon hotel, and I'm very excited. Man, I am so excited about this whole VidCon thing. And I got so excited that I went on Facebook, and I was like, Guys, I booked my hotel for VidCon. And I'm pretty sure most of my friends on Facebook are like, I don't know what VidCon is, but good for you. But then one person was like, I want to go to VidCon. So I'm going to be going to VidCon with a friend. And that's very exciting. Because I love people. People are great. Especially the people I know. Like you guys. Although maybe I don't really know all of you. But I'll pretend. Um, this guy, under the account of Explore List, uh, said in a comment in my last vlog video uh, that I have a... Like, I'm really charismatic. Or what did he say? I'm confident. And he thought maybe it's because I've been vlogging for a hot minute. The truth is, I guess technically I have. I mean, the first videos I made were back in 2006, 2007. Um, but I am just naturally confident, or not <laughs> confidence, um, but social. I'm very social, um, and I'm very extroverted, and I like talking, which a lot of people don't. But for me, f for whatever reason, I'm like, I don't care. Give me a crowd, and I'll speak to them like, like a champion, because I have too much to say, I guess, or something. Um... For those of you who are waiting for my series, I'm thinking mainly you, Anthony, uh, and whoever else really cares about my plans for everything in the future. Um, I'm writing the scripts for the three-part series that I'll be doing. It's slow going, but it is going. So hopefully I will have the outline of what I want to say done, and then I'll flesh it out with the actual words, and then I'll record the videos. Um, and I'm thinking I'm going to try and record the videos all three in like the same week and try and maybe even in the same day so that I keep a good continual pace. Um, but I will try, I'll try to stagger their release. Um, but I don't know over what amount of time. We'll see if it's a weekly or bi weekly or semi weekly thing. I'll let you know. Well, you'll find out when they pop up, won't you? Alright. Um, I'm going to Taipei. Uh, my friend was like, hey, Peter, you should go to Taipei with me for New Year's Eve, because there's going to be a ripping party. And I'm like, ripping party, you say, in Taipei? Wait a second, I speak Chinese. This should work out quite well. Hmm. So, now, besides going to England, uh, in the middle of my road trip, I will be going to Taiwan, which is cool, because I would like to go to Taiwan. 
like to go back to China. Use my language before it all fades away. 如果你正在住在台北的话，呃，告诉我，然后我们可以呃联合在一起，然后玩一玩，或者买点客店咖啡，或者茶，呃，对。So let me know. Uh, if you oh, Steve Miller. I don't know why, but I really like you. You and your glorious head head that's so so bald and so endearing. Um you're always making comments on my videos and I feel like even though I I reply to all of them I think you deserve a shout out. So Steve Miller, you're awesome. And if you guys don't know who Steve Miller is, check out the comments in any of my videos because he posts in all of them. And go check out his channel. Right now he's living in Korea and he works for I think a television station out there making some kind of TV show, but he's a very good entertaining personality, and he's got a lot of really deep things to say too sometimes. Um, and he is part of the Hanteming just like me, and just like Victoria, and just like Tracy, uh, and any of my other viewers who I apologize for ever being forgotten. Okay, uh, and finally, Nature Chief, you're crazy. <laughs> I just want to throw that out there. I just watched some of your videos earlier tonight, right before going to bed, and you are Fengla is what they would say in Chinese, which, yes, means crazy, but you're hilarious. So I subscribed, um, and wherever you are, let me know, and I will totally just randomly show up at your doorstep, and we will do a collab, because I feel like that would be really fun. Uh, I do accents, too, and not just when I speak foreign languages, but every now and then I get a little crazy. And if that's not an accent, like, if that's actually how you talk, God bless you, sir. I think you're a fantastic human being. You're ridiculous. And everyone else should check out Nature Chief's channel, too. He's posted a few comments in my other videos as well. Um, okay, that's all I got, and I will talk to you guys later. Bye. Oh, and I love you, because I do, because you're great. All right, bye.